Hi everyone, I wanna talk about your roof today. If you don't know when your roof was last replaced, let's talk a little bit about that process, how that works, how your home insurance covers it, and uh, why it might be worth getting it checked out. So most roofs, when they are put on, your roofer will tell you that it's gonna be a 20 year shingle, a 30 year shingle. If you live in the DFW area, it's highly unlikely that it will actually live that entire life. And that's because we get so many crazy storms that involve hail, wind, trees that might fall on your house, et cetera, et cetera. So it's always good to get your home checked out after a big, a major storm. Now, hail doesn't necessarily fall in the most logical of places. Your neighbor may get hail damage on your roof and you might not, but it's extremely easy if you don't know um, to get your roof checked and to see if you got any damage that, that would really result in either having your roof compromised or need it needing to be replaced. So it's it's helpful to get it checked after any major storm. Again, if you don't really know the last time that it was replaced, if you bought this house and you haven't had any damage since then, it might be time to get a roofer to come out and check your roof. Now, after a major storm, you're gonna get a lot of little cards, business cards to your door saying, hey, let us do your roof, let us check it out. Not all roofers are created equal, so make sure that you're discerning. We have quite a few roofers that we work with, trust, and really like the work that they do, so please reach out to us if you need a recommendation. Roofers do not have to be licensed here in the state of Texas, so just any old person can be a roofer. And what you don't wanna do is have your insurance company pay them a lot of money for a new roof and for your roof not to be in good shape or to be put on properly. So that definitely be protective of your roof. But the simplest thing to do would be after a storm or if you just don't know how long it's been, have a roofer come out. They're gonna get right up on the roof. Typically they can come same day or next day, check things out. It's super easy. You don't even have to be around. They can just put a ladder up and get on your roof and they'll give you a report on how it looks, uh, what they recommend. Does it, does it look completely fine? Does it need a little tune up, a couple shingles replaced? Um, or does it, do they think that it would qualify for a full replacement? If it does look like it qualifies for a full replacement, it's likely in your best interest to get that roof replaced so that you don't end up with any leaks or water damage in your home. The only thing that you need to be aware of is just be prepared to pay your deductible. So uh, be aware of what that is and what that might cost you. Typically, most insurance companies, you're going to pay your deductible and then they're going to pay everything that the roof costs over that. So if the roofer comes to you and says, hey, it's, it's probably time for a full roof replacement, you're going to call your insurance company, make a claim. That roofer will kind of give you the date that they think all of the damage occurred, what was the latest storm in your area. Now, don't worry if that was a year or so ago, there's no kind of limit on that. So the damage still may have happened then. You'll call them, you'll, you'll make a claim, and then they're gonna send out their adjuster from the insurance company to see if it's necessary to replace your roof. It's in your best interest to get your roofer to meet that adjuster and any good roofing company is gonna wanna meet that adjuster out at your house and kind of explain to them everything that, they, that they've found, the reason that they should approve your claim and really try to make that process successful for you. Your insurance company is then gonna get back to you with their uh, results, what they've determined. Now they may deny your claim and say, hey, there's not enough damage and you can just move along. As long as you don't have any leaks in your house, then you're in good shape. But they may say that it's time for a full roof replacement. In that case, then you're gonna continue working with your trusty roofer. You're gonna usually get kind of half of the money up front to replace the roof, and then they'll pay that contractor directly once the roof is completely replaced. Uh, this whole process from start to finish typically can take like less than a month. So um, it's, it's pretty, pretty painless um, and may result in you getting a brand new roof. So make sure that you're checking it out. A roof is one of the major systems in your home. You wanna make sure that it's protecting you the way that it should. If you have any questions, let us know.